How's it going, everybody? I'm Jack McAdoo. I hope this day finds you doing really well. I want to talk to you about a daily routine that you should get into, and that's taking time for yourself. No matter if you're married, single, single parent, no matter what it is, no matter if you're working all kinds of hours, whatever the situation, you need to find time for yourself. And that means just shutting everything down, putting your cell phones away, turning off the TV, everything, no noise, and just take time to sit and relax and reflect on the day and see what lessons there were during the day and then just let all that go and just sit in silence and find some peace. The next thing you can do is meditate, pray, meditate, but I'm going to focus on meditation. Meditation is not where you need incense burning. You don't have to have spiritual woo-woo music. <laughs> You don't have to be on a hill in the sun with flowers with a goat. You don't need any of that. Meditation is the present moment. You just need to stop, close your eyes, and get grounded. And just begin to focus on your breath. In and out. Focus on the breath. And that's all you need to do. And you begin to relax as you're focusing on your breath. Your mind centers around the breath and thoughts just go away for the day. You can change your life just by meditation. Prayer, for instance, you begin praying immediately. You sit down, let's pray, and you pray. Same thing with meditation. You sit down and you begin to meditate. This is an opportunity for you to get into a theta state. Once you practice, you can get into theta in early stages of delta. And what these do, what these states do scientifically proven you can it's the gateway to your subconscious mind and you begin to rework your subconscious mind relearn things upload software download software put in the new version of yourself and the way that's done using meditation as a tool is throughout the day you visualize your future your abundant future not what you're living in now the lack you cannot have an amazing future if you're still worried about yesterday. It's impossible because you're focused on yesterday, your lack, whatever's bothering you. The way you act today is based on memories that you created yesterday. So you need to reprogram that. You need to get out of that. You cannot have an amazing future with a junk past. So by closing your eyes and seeing the best version of yourself that you want to see, whether it's money, riches, fame, fortune, a better family, a better relationship with your whoever it is, your significant. You can reprogram all those things by closing your eyes and visualizing it, living in that abundant state. Where your thoughts go, energy flows. And you all know that. So by closing your eyes, you're tricking your brain because your brain does not have a mind of its own. <laughs> Your brain can't tell the difference of what you're visualizing and what you're actually seeing. So by doing this, it's, n n magic isn't just going to happen and stuff's going to fall out of the sky. But what it's going to do is going to align your thoughts with your actions. And where your thoughts go, the energy goes. And those things will come to you. Opportunities will arise for you to achieve certain things. And that's how that works. Nothing falls from the sky. Nothing's magic. It doesn't just appear, but things open up for you to get to it. So meditation is key, absolute key. But just take time for yourself. You can't live in fear all the time or with chaos going around you. Not necessarily fear, but with chaos. Because if you have stress in your life and depression in your life and you're always thinking negative and what am I going to do and what am I going to do with this and how am I going to fix that, you can get sick. You can fluctuate in weight. Diets won't work. All kinds of things will happen to you. I know. Trust. I've been there. But this is the way to get out of it. Find time for yourself. Even if you don't want to meditate or, or anything like that, I suggest it. But find time for yourself. you got to breathe. you got to shut down. you got to shut everybody out. Half an hour a day. Just do it. Do it when you wake up. Do it when you go to sleep. It doesn't matter when you do it. Just do it. And I guarantee you, after a few times of this, practicing it, you're going to feel a lot better. You're going to look at things different. You're going to look at people differently. So try it. What do you have to lose?
Stress? <laughs> anyway, you guys take care. I'm Jack McAdoo. Peace and aloha, everybody.